Okay. All right. So, um, and and you know, Ward or Eric or or Peter, any of you who are Federated Wiki people, if you are here and you want to jump in, please feel free. Um, you should be able to now. I've made you all panelists, so you should just be able to jump in at any time. Um, <clears throat> so, what I'm sharing is this is. OK, so actually, before we even talk about what's on the screen, let me talk about the, the kind of the fundamental difference that is a federated wiki from what I would call a traditional wiki like Wikipedia. OK, so Wikipedia, as we, as we discussed a bit before, says, here is one website, and anybody in the world can edit it. But if two different people have different ideas about how to write an article about frogs or about any of the topics that we've talked about here today, you kind of have to work it out together um, before, you, you know, to put something out. You can work it out as you're working on it, but at any one time, there's only one article on English Wikipedia about frogs. Federated Wiki uh, has a different model. And actually I'm going to, I, I'm gonna, the first page I'm gonna show you is a graphic that I uh, just put together that kind of illustrates this. So, so this, this diagram describes what I just said. Okay, the wiki, like Wikipedia, there's one wiki in the middle and Serena and Raphael and Venus, if they wanna work on it, they're all working on the same thing. Federated wiki is a different model. That says if Venus and Serena and Raphael are all the people who wanna work on it, well, Venus gets to work on Venus's wiki, Serena gets to work on Serena's wiki, and Raphael gets to work on Raphael's wiki, and then there is interaction among those different websites. So, um, so they can have the same page. Like, let's say that these three tennis players are all interested in frogs. So Venus writes a, a page on her own website that only she can edit about frogs, and Maybe Raphael sees that and he says, oh, that's a pretty good start. Well, the software makes it very easy to copy Venus's article about frogs onto his website, Raphael's wiki. And then he can change it there, but now he's making changes here. So hers still exists the way that she wrote it. His still exists the way that he wrote it and they're linked together. So you can, you can find one easily from the other. Ooh. So let me give you kind of a, a, a an idea of how that how that works. You know this 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 particular this page where I describe the concept. This is a good example of it: federated versus non-federated wiki, right? So I wrote up this description and I made these diagrams here. But then, if you look up at the top, this this purple square this indicates my site, and this one here where it says older this indicates someone else's site. So I'm going to hover over it. I don't know whether, does it say mark.dojo? Do you see that yeah. on your screen? Okay. Yeah. So that's the person whose site this square represents. So Mark has an older version of this page, mm -hmm. which means either he made it first and then I forked it and made some edits to it, or maybe he forked it, meaning made a copy of it. And then since then I've made more edits to mine. Mm -hmm. But if we wanna see his, I'm gonna just hold the shift key and click on his, and now we get to see these two panels side by side. Hmm. And if I hold the shift key while I scroll, notice, see how it turns yellow? It highlights. Uh, something's blocking here. Uh, okay. Try again, okay. Okay, can you see that some of the text is yellow? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so that's because I'm holding the shift key and the, what that does is wherever my mouse is hovering, it highlights that paragraph and it highlights it in both panels. Uh -huh. So it lets you kind of compare what's the mm -hmm. same between these two versions. Mm -hmm. And in this case, this may not be the best example because it looks like they're pretty much exactly the same. Yeah. Um, but if I, you know, if I pick a different one, like, so I'm, so welcome visitors is kind of the default starting page for everyone when you start mm -hmm. one of these. So with welcome visitors, there will definitely be some differences. So I'm going to pull up Mark's welcome visitors page. Actually, I'm going to get rid of these ones and we're going to forget about mm -hmm. this page. We've gotten enough from that one. So I'm going to just get those out of our view. 
And now we're looking at my welcome visitors page and we're looking at Mark's welcome visitors page. Mm -hmm. And you see, these are completely different pages. Yes. Right, Mark, I've put some comments and links to stuff that I'm interested in. Mark has put some comments and stuff that he's interested in. But if mm -hmm. I hold the shift key, it's not, it's <laughs> finding very little right. that is that it considers the same. There's a little bit, mm -hmm. but um, you know, because they, you know, it might recognize that there's sort of a common history to this paragraph, you know, uh, mm -hmm. that maybe we kind of edited the same thing. But for the most part, we've just got separate pages here. Mm -hmm. So when people talk about federated wiki, it's, I mean, literally the word federated is, it, it's, it's a big concept in sort of internet theory these days that there are certain kinds of services that like they honor your ownership over your content and they say you can make your own website and it's federated just in the sense that like the United States are federated. We have a federation where like every state has its own government, mm -hmm. but then there's a system for how those governments interact. The federal government is a system for how the state governments interact. It's the same concept here. It's like there's, you know, certain newer collaboration software is built on the, the model that nobody owns your data, but you, you can have your very own website and it, there should be protocols for how that website talks to other websites. Mm. It is fascinating and, and a little dense for me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I may have covered about as much as is reasonable to get into in seven minutes. Probably, um, I think you have, yeah. yeah. I, but I think we need to come back to it. To, it sounds, sounds like agree. this might have, might have been a useful thing to put that uh, wiki dialect glossary that I, on. Is it, it could be. Yeah, and we could, uh, yeah, let's let's talk about that. If Maybe I can uh, move it because I don't like where it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, great. Well, thank you. It's been fun. All right. Well, I don't I don't see any other volunteers jumping up in the chat, and I think that we have maybe uh, run our course with this event. <laughs> I think uh, maybe I... we're the last last ones left. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Ah, I see Max still Hi, here. Mac. Hi, Mac. <laughs> Thanks for sticking it out, Mac. Yeah. Hey, I'm learning some things. Like I said, Love this is a listening. Oh, there's activity. Peter. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, been, been busy on other things, kind of in the background. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, did you see, was it our, our venture into Federated Wiki that brought you back? Yeah, well, I just, I had, I had a break in my other work and it's like, oh, uh -huh. yeah, and I'm, uh -huh. I'm kind of listening. Yeah. I, I do that a lot. It's like internet, um, uh, is a it's kind of a, a side stream thing for me. Yeah. It's like internet speed dating. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like I got I got too much stuff going on. I, I'm, I got some code I'm dropping. So I'm better good. than not enough. <laughs> I think so. That's the one thing about the the whole pandemic and being at home and stuff like that. I feel like I'm busier and all than I've ever been before. Between you know, I got time to fix up the plumbing at home and <laughs> code up these little projects and do this kind of stuff, which is a, kind of a social interesting world that I haven't really stepped into. Uh, well, it's good timing. We were, uh, uh, you may not have heard it, but I was actually calling your name out uh, because my mom was curious what this federated wiki thing oh, is. Oh gosh, I think there's gotta so be a way to- I just gave her a quick intro. A little more um, uh, conveniently for uh, um, non-computer geek users. It's still a computer geek thing. This is like you know, early wiki days for the original wiki. <laughs> Something like Wikipedia will happen to it eventually, and it'll become popular. But right now, it's it's a geeky thing. But it's powerful, and and the geeks who use it have fun with it. So I think I, I just want to say our, we're down to uh, ten people in total right now. So anybody that's still uh, hanging back and listening, uh, please feel free to turn on your mic, turn on your camera, um, and let's uh, let's say good night. Let's say good night. Yeah. Uh, we can take take further comments or questions if you have something that's been on your mind the whole time. Uh, but let's wrap it up in the next few minutes. Got to, got to get the design for the wiki cookies or have, you know, <laughs> some sort of merchandise. You can merch that maybe. Yeah. Cool. Daniel, was that um? I, you were asking about FedWiki. I guess I should mention we do. Ward has been hosting a Wednesday morning. Uh, it's ten a.m. Pacific time call every Wednesday for the last maybe 10 years. Uh, and we've recently added a Sunday morning. So I guess it would be, uh, you know, sort of midday, uh, either on Wednesdays or on Sundays, your time. 
Um, you're, are you in Virginia these days? <laughs> no, yeah. I'm in oh, Europe. You're, you're in Europe. Okay, so it'd be evening. Um, yeah. But that's that's an opportunity if you if you want to delve into the details. It's, it's I know I've actually good. attended a few of those. Okay, good. That, that time doesn't work for me normally, um, and yeah, but I'm I'm still I still have my copy of Federated Wiki somewhere. Excellent. <laughs> And uh, I'm, I remain interested in, in the concept and would love to uh, be, um, let's say, involved in, in some fashion for ex little experiments um, like this one. That was good. So I, for instance, I didn't know about the highlighting thing. <laughs> good. Okay. Well, I think we should, uh, we, we should set up something at a time that is good for you. I'm always happy to, to do, you know, it could be one-on-one -on -one or a small group. Um, but I'd, I'd, I'd be interested to do that. Okay. You'll Good see to him. see you, Jim. <laughs> Another face I haven't seen for a while. I say Jim, he says Edward. I know him as Jim. <laughs> <laughs> well, all I can see is Mac, Max. Oh, yeah, oh yes. Same thing. Yeah. Computer calls me Edward. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, yeah. So it seems QAnon is the thing to engage with if you want to do DIY culture. I, I'm not entirely sure this categorization is proper. <laughs> <laughs> but can you remind us, Mac? What was this? Uh, oh, this was the. The DIY thing. in a Wikipedia category of DIY culture. This was the articles with the most views. Interesting. Got to be careful we, we, oh, on Wikipedia now. It's it's, it's getting like social media. <laughs> <laughs> That's really interesting. Yeah. I can't oh. see any people. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> I think it's because oh, Mac there is they are. They're hidden so. under my chat thing. Yeah. There we are. Okay. <laughs> there we are. Well, I'm going to leave. God bless you all. Thank you very much. Stay healthy. Same here. Nice. Thanks a lot, guys. Had Big a great quest. time. Yeah, thanks for sticking it out to the end. And uh, I'll, I'll send an email around. Uh, I, I think it would be great to do a follow-up session, whether it's on Federated Wiki or, uh, or some other topics. So I'll be sure and let you all know. All right. I'd really like to know about that. Great. If you want to stick around, Peter, we could maybe yak one. Well, I've actually, I actually have uh, somewhere I was going to get going when we're when we're done with this, but I will okay. only talk to you in the next day or so. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good. If it's if it's important, I can call you this evening. No, no, it's okay. Yeah. Just just generally a little okay. more on what we what what you were showing me about here. Okay. Also, also I had another one of those ca uh, candy things or something today, and uh, chased it down, got rid of it. Computer issues abound. Yeah. We'll track them down. Okay. All upstairs. <laughs> anyway. Well, thank you everybody for coming. This has really been uh, a lot of fun for me and I hope it has for all of you too. Bye. Bye for now.